Greetings everyone. In this video, we are going to install Hummingbot, using a Linux machine at DigitalOcean. This will be a Docker type installation, which is the easiest method. DigitalOcean, is a popular cloud service solution, since it is very easy to use. Please note, that you need to key in, your credit card details, before you can use the service. After that, your account will be credited, with $100, as a signed up bonus, which will expire in 60 days. Let us get started. We start by creating a droplet or a cloud server. We clicked on create, and then selected droplets. For the image, we selected, Ubuntu 22.04. For the plan, we selected, basic. For CPU options, we selected, regular with SSD. We selected, $48 per month. To maximize $100 credit, for 2 months. For data center region, we selected, New York. For authentication, we selected, password. And then, we typed our, password. Please note, to comply with all the password requirements. For the host name, we are calling it, Hummingbot01. And finally, we clicked on, create droplet, button. Please wait, for few minutes. DigitalOcean is now spinning up, the droplet, or cloud server. Alright. DigitalOcean's cloud server setup is, indeed, quick and easy. Now, our cloud server is ready. We need to take note of its IP address. The next thing we need to do, is connect to our DigitalOcean's droplet. For that we will be using, the Solar Putty SSH tool which is available in Windows. If you need some guide on how to use this tool, please let us know in the comments below. So, in Solar Putty, we have set up our credentials, using the droplet's IP address, and password. Now, we simply double click, to connect to our droplet. Before proceeding further, for reference, we will start following the installation steps, as described in the official, Hummingbot documentation. We are now visiting this documentation page. We navigated to, installation section. And then to, docker. We then scroll down, a little bit, to Linux section. Alright. Now, we can then proceed to install Docker, and Hummingbot within our, Linux droplet. Let us begin, the Docker installation process. What follows, is a set of commands, that you can copy, and paste, in sequence. Please see these commands, under Docker install commands, in the YouTube description below. Now, we are back at our droplets terminal, where we have connected earlier, using the Solar Putty SSH tool. It is time for us, then, to execute the commands. The first command, is about downloading the script, so we can install, docker, in step 3, below. The second command, is for changing the permission, of .sh file, to enable the script in our system. And finally, the third command, is for installing, docker. The docker installation process will take 2 to 5 minutes to complete. So, I will be back shortly after docker installation is completed. Alright. Docker installation, is completed. We can check it with this command, docker dash dash version. Before we proceed with Hummingbot installation, we need to update, and upgrade, our Ubuntu system. Please use the command, you see on screen. These processes will take 3 to 6 minutes. So, I will be back in a while. Up next, is the Hummingbot installation using scripts, which is the easiest method. Let us begin the Hummingbot installation process. What follows is another set of commands that you can copy, and paste, in sequence. Please see these commands, under Hummingbot installation commands, in the YouTube description below. The first command, is for downloading the create script, which will allow us to create a Hummingbot instance. The second command, is for downloading the start script, which will enable us to start Hummingbot instance that we have created. The third command, is for downloading the update script, which will be used for updating to higher version of Hummingbot. Upgrading is scheduled at every end of the month. Finally, the fourth command, is for changing the permission of .sh files to enable the scripts in our system. We are now ready to create our first, Hummingbot instance. 
let us create our first bot by using the create script. We press enter to select the latest version. Next, we named our test as testbot. Next, we press enter to accept the default name of the folder. Then type y for yes. Downloading of Docker images are started. This will take 5 to 8 minutes. So, I will be back in a while. Alright. Moving on. We press enter three times. Then we type our password twice to confirm we entered them correctly. Be sure to remember it, as you will use it every time you start your bot. Then, we also just press enter twice to confirm the config's migration. That's it. We have fully completed the installation process. We are now in Hummingbot dashboard. Congratulations. You are now one of the smart crypto traders using Hummingbot as your market making and trading toolset. As a recap, in this video we have done the following. 1. Created a new droplet or cloud server in DigitalOcean. 2. Installed Docker. And finally 3. Installed Hummingbot. If you have encountered some issues during your installation, please ask for assistance at our Hummingbot Discord server, specifically in Support Channel. We will be happy to help you. And finally, as usual, please press the like button of this video and press subscribe. This will really help Hummingbot community to grow exponentially. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.